welcome back you guys to another episode of my podcast miss unconventional and for you youtubers out there that are watching me on youtube on my um youtube channel Men at melinda j thank you for watching this video and tuning in so today i am doing something different that i'm starting off with and it's going to be called a self-care checkup so what i have asked for my spirit guides is what does the collective need to focus on um this week and the card vanity had pulled out from the chakra deck and i don't have the deck with me at this oh yes i do <laughs> And this is the deck that I pulled it out from. And um, this is, yeah, the bottom of the deck was another card that came out. It was not growth, but um, at the time, the bottom of the deck, when I, when this card pulled out was Discovery. So we're going to go into the corresponding book that came with this particular deck and it's from the chakra wisdom oracle guidebook and it states for the card vanity that i need more better bigger yes that will make me okay and from this picture that it depicts it explains that the legend peter um crystal peter and mike are at a party and mike posh home Toasting success in their business, a mysterious old man appears and asks them whether they prefer glutony or generosity. Puzzled and none of them answered, he reminds them that more does not mean better and they laugh. Suddenly they are all alone, far from the party and rising water. We're getting more, cries Peter. Rain falls and the water rises faster. Play, shouts crystal we must do well with what we have as they begin to have fun in the water the rain stops the inspiration for this particular card is states that we all say we will stop when we have enough but there's never enough you may be looking outside yourself for validation and the personal inquiry is states Am I feeling disconnected from any people in my life or am I growing away from limiting relationships? The key idea states environmental tensions, living in illusions, self-doubt, power to change, lesser companions, empty conversations, and the key words are faith, awareness, and transformation. And if you want to go a little bit deeper, <laughs> here's a quick meditation for you. And it states, visualizing an aqua light within you. Imagine people you love surrounding you. Feel the light building and spilling onto your loved ones. Send gratitude to those you love and those you have yet to meet. Bless them all. Notice the energy and any messages that you receive. So, in other words, the question that you need to be asking besides the uh, personal inquiry that states in the guidebook is, are you seeking validation from anything right now? And look within yourself. Please look within yourself and ask, are you seeking validation where there needs to be no validation at? In my case, for example, um, I have a tendency to overgive and also, um, you know, become a people pleaser sometimes. Or if I'm, um, or when it comes to my creativity, you know, I ask people, you know, is this okay? Is, that, is this okay? Instead of just going with my instinct and just be like, okay, bam, here we are. Um, if you like it, fine. If not, then I'm going to ask another person. So, with all in a nutshell, vanity is the focus for this week and pertaining to this chakra card. And so, for clarification, oh, 
clarification. <laughs> for clarification, I pulled out another card. Um, this card had popped out from another chakra deck, and this is the chakra deck that I purchased at um, Five Below. So feel free to check the, your local Five Below, <laughs> and it came with this corresponding book and also a um, a chakra chart as well, which I'll be getting that laminated soon. And this card, it states the third chakra, the solar plexus, and it's talking about self-confidence. So as stated on this card, it says, I trust myself fully. I will not allow fear or doubt to hold me back from doing what I'm here to do. I have confidence, belief, and conviction in my abilities and goals. I welcome questioning by others as this gives me a chance to clarify my truth, ideas, and philosophies. I trust in a higher power and I am open to new challenges. So, the focus that the collective, as well as myself, for this week is vanity and self-confidence so i hope you all like this video share and subscribe to the youtube channel for all my podcasters out there be sure to subscribe um for my podcast as well as leave a review if you like the content that i'm presenting so far and i'll see you all in the next video and also the next episode and until next time Preserve your energy and you're too blessed to be stressed. Bye.